I'm going to show you how simple it is to mint a contract in the Ford factory. And today we're going to be looking at the ERC20 mintable ownable token contract. To get started, head over to the marketplace. And in the marketplace, you'll find all the templates that are available in Ford factory. We're going to be talking about the ERC mintable ownable token contract today. You click on that link and it takes you through to the description of the contract where you can see if this is a contract that you'd like to use in your environment. The different features are displayed below and if you're happy with those features then head across to the right hand side and click deploy. This will take you to the UI template builder and this is the drag and drop no code builder which allows you to fully customize the way the contract displays in your business environment. There are various functions on the top which you can use to customize this and let's just start by going through the basics to understand what level of customization you can actually use in your environment. You can insert links, quotes, you can insert text sections, you can change the column layouts, the different font layouts, you can add images, you can add videos, nav bars, countdowns, and then there are also various levels of contract integration that you can use in this contract. I'm not going to be covering that today in this video. What I'm going to do is just show you the basics of how to put this contract together. So if you wanted to use this text section, for example, just go across the right hand bar, drag and drop it in. You can customize that text to whatever you need and then deploy it in your environment. If you want to change the coloring, just go and collect on, on the holder and go to decorations. The background color is easy, customizable and you could choose red. That actually looks quite cool. But if you didn't like that and you wanted green, you could put green in there. So let's go ahead and assume that we like this and let's just save this template. Now what we're going to do is to edit the template and give it a name, give it an icon and give it a description. So the person actually utilizing this template understands what you're trying to achieve and that they've got the right template. So the name that we're going to choose is the Mitch Mintable Ownable Contract and I'm going to upload an icon here. This is the Mitch tokening image icon. The description is Mitch Mintable Ownable and the subdomain will be Mitch Mintable Ownable. The name is going to be Mitch Mintable Ownable and we are going to give the token a name. We're going to call it Mitch Mintable Ownable. Let's just check that we've got everything right. It all looks good. Let's submit the contract. You can see it's connecting to MetaMask and it's going through for us to confirm that we actually want to mint this contract on chain. I'm accepting to do that. It goes through, checks the contract deployment and I'm going to confirm that transaction. And now it's pending to deploy. Usually, depending on traffic, this takes between 10 and 12 seconds. Some days it's a bit longer, but you can see that the contract's actually been deployed and the application is deployed live. And now if I come across to my applications, I can see that in my applications, I've got the Mitch Mintable Ownable contract and it's ready to deploy. In the next video, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to use this contract and how you can mint tokens and how you can transfer tokens to a third party. See you in the next video.